just a day and a half ago, barely 36 hours that New Horizons swept down over Ultima Thule in a technical success beyond anything ever attempted before in spaceflight. Here's where we were just, just a couple days ago on December 31st, 2018. This was humanity's best image of Ultima Thule, made by New Horizons at a range of about half a million kilometers out. Well, that image is so 2018. <laughs> Meet Ultima Thule. Just like with Pluto, we could not be happier. What you're seeing is the first contact binary ever explored by spacecraft. That bowling pin is gone. <laughs> it's a snowman, if it's anything at all. And, you know, we have to start thinking about some provisional names, and particularly we need names right up front for the two lobes so that we can refer to them individually. Now, being scientists, we're not all that creative with words, so what we've decided to do is name one lobe Ultima and the other Thule. I'm excited today to introduce you to the color of Ultima Thule. Mm -hmm. So on the left-hand side, you're seeing an enhanced color image. So this is the near IR, the red and the blue, taken by the Ralph instrument, the MVIC, um, part of the Ralph instrument. In the middle, you're seeing the lorry image that we've already discussed. And on the right-hand side is the color image overlaid onto that lorry. We had a rough color from Hobart or but now we can definitively say the Ultima Thule is red. And I want to bring to everybody's attention that these, this coming together, the lobes would be at an extremely slow speed. It would be like about maybe one or a few miles an hour, the speed in which um, you uh, might park your car uh, in, the, uh, in a, uh, at a parking space, or if you had a collision of another car at those speeds, you may not even bother to fill out the insurance forms. <laughs> Questions?